Hey mercenaries, welcome back to Opal Plays Mech Warrior 5. We're in the Cars Farm system and we picked up a interesting mech last time for salvage. Something I very rarely do. Wanted to take a good hard look at it. The Battlemaster 1GD. Not quite a hero mech, but it's an upgraded one and a pretty much a... Uh, we'll take a look at the loadout. It's a customized mech. It's got funny things, see? Pulse laser? Yeah, yeah, it's got a quirk. Not sure what a repair all is going to get me, but... Yeah. It's got an enhancement for medium pulse lasers. I got a bunch of... I almost never use them. So the good part is, that means I have a bunch. But do I have six all the same? I have seven. How about that? Man, I know I got a better six than that. How about that one? We'll just put that somewhere else. See what else I can do here. So if I give it a 355, it's already a good speed. I'm a ton and a half over. Don't want that. I can give it an XL engine. I'm pretty sure I've got one or two. I got three. But then what do you do, really? <clears throat> I think I know what I'm going to do. Let's give it that. Eh, it doesn't really matter all that much. I'll give it that one still. I can make it nice and cool. I'm going to take one of these, at least one, and make it a large something. It might be even a PPC. How about if we do that? And that. And I still got plenty of weight for cooling. Do I even have enough cooling to make that worthwhile? Not really, he says. Give it a sensor. Best I got. Why? So what have I got? I got 82 points of alpha strike in an 85 ton mech. That meets my requirements. 146 days. Now, we're not in a hurry. I wouldn't be here. Any gyros or anything still? Hey, starting to get gyros. About time. That's about as hero mech as you can make a non-hero mech, you know what I mean? Let's see, we're going to go ahead and paint. And do it the easy way to paint everybody. Pick one that's already painted. And do that. So, that's going to be a while. Yeah, that's going to be a while. I got 32 days until I get my... Uh, starting lineup back. How about those Waco Rangers? Pretty sure I got them. The big W. Dragoons I got. Northwind Highlanders didn't have anybody there. It might not still. 
don't have Hanson's Rough Riders or the uh, Graves Death Legion. So let's, uh, well, I got a Kestrel mission I got to do. Yep, promised to myself I'd do every one of those that I could. I see one, I'm going to go do it. All the DLC specifics. Not the generic, you know, high reward missions. Not all of them, but all of the specific to the DLC ones. By which I mean it actually shows up with the emblem now that they do that on the star map. This is Project Cold Snap. It's only a level 7. So we'll see if we can get through it real quick here. 50 campaign, 250 tons. Well, now that's a good coincidence right there. The beginning of the uh, Dragon's Gambit starts off at 250 tons. So let's go ahead and work my way down to that weight. That doesn't mean I'm going to take all four pilots. Because I'm going to have to wiggle in some other mechs. Although I do have that Crusader I just picked up as a reward. Let's, uh, let's look over here. Get some lighter mix in here. I'll throw in this. Throw in that one. And that one. I should be able to make something work with this. 250 tonner. I'm going to take me. I think my uh, Orion P. Yep, I do happen to have it in there. 17 for missiles. Begs for, for the uh, Kintaro, doesn't it? <coughs> Golden boy. Good gunnery and energy. Thought he had a gun. Just the missiles. How about that? Let's see how the weight comes out. 45 tons means I'll go a little bit over, but <coughs> no sin there. Let's go do some damage. Wrong cursor.
think they'd had enough by now. Well, don't stop on my account. I'm running the modification for no artillery. There's also an in-game selector you can do to take zero damage from artillery. So while the mod doesn't make it go away, it just makes it so it can't target you. It'll shoot, but it's ineffective. I'm saving ammo. Project Cold Snap is pretty aptly named, isn't it? If I remember correctly, part two of this is like 96 days away. Maybe I can get some mercenaries between here and there. It's way over towards what happens to now be free Rasselhaig. Enforcements there. Target acquired. Target destroyed. The enemy are deploying still more reinforcements, Commander. Which means yet another. Yeah, sure, you got it. Let's take it, dude. Note to self, take a uh, cantina mission for VTOLs. And then come take this mission. And learn how to shoot a LBX. Keep running. Exactly. He just folded. 
think we need to go this way. Get out the way, Mr. Flea. Looks like he's over here instead. Yep. That should be the end. Special leg job. Yeah, must have some buddies out there. There he is. Yeah, yeah. Ah. Get out of the way, buddy. Come on, I'll take you missile for missile. Yes, I did. Now you want to take out this guy? We gotta make our allied friend there do it. It's pretty bad when you're chasing a mech that's much faster than you. And he's winning. I don't, Let's finish this off and get off this dump. I don't see him taking any damage. Like he's not fighting anybody. I got a feeling I should have went down over here. Arr. That's the problem with these kill all mechs. They need to be programmed to run at you and teleport if necessary. There's one. Well, well, you're not going to get rich playing level seven high reward missions, but uh, you will get reputation points faster, get promoted faster. Which, if you're playing the uh, campaign, that gets you through it much faster. That's a pretty high level of targets. Let's see. Hold snap two. Got some decent stuff. I'd like to see a number after that one. And where is that? Yeah, way over there. That's what I thought. I got a filthy lucre right there. Okay, I'm going to go up near the handsome Rough Riders, at least. And it's 76 days away. And we, of course, will travel that in the blink of an eye. Slow blink, but a blink. couple of blinks. So back. I'll think about that. I 
think I got enough pilots. 50, 250. Same, same. And a demolition. I think we're pretty well set up for demolitions. I think I'll check out my missile mix and make sure that they have a option for yeah see they don't giving them an option for group fire allows them to really do a demo just continuous fire now who would do that I think I will leave that on one. I have no idea if I ever get down to that. How the AI works. The mystery to everybody, including the people that make mods to improve it. I know the basics. Having read about it, but not done it. It's, it's kind of what I used to do. Before I retired at 55, because I could. I'm going to get up on this hill and see what I can do from afar. Okay, retiring at 55. From the IT industry doesn't mean you're phenomenal. It means you're sort of good. Just waited for him to fall under my cursor. Seem to hit that guy. There we go. It's a slippery devil, too. funny, I give all the other guys a uh, chain fire option on their missiles, but I don't have one because I've only got the one missile. I'm 
There come some targets. Hey, Hanshi. Pretty quick. New target, Orion. Yeah, let it go. Not playing for salvage. Task is done. There's no further need for you to remain at this facility. If House Steiner insists on keeping this pile of rubble, they are free to take it. Return to your dropship, leave this place, and our business will be complete. The Dragon thanks you for your assistance in this delicate matter. Let's get you out of there, Commander. Stand by. Well, two picks gets me two picks. Toothpicks, basically. Not a well done mission. And a lot of good loot. Look at that. Good stuff. Let's go ahead and repair up. Now the real question is what is the level here? Level 12? Oh yeah. That's going to give me some combat bucks. And we're coming up right on 30 minutes, so this is going to be in the next episode, if in fact it is, and it is a battlefield against Sanson's Rough Riders. We'll see you for that one. Don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe. Uh, all three in that order would be nice. We'll see you then. Hope is out.